Wall Street got just what it expected. The Federal Reserve slashed its key interest rate by half a percent and left the door open for even more cuts in the future. The hope is cheaper loans will speed up the economy and prevent a recession. A rally at the stock market fizzled in the final minutes and the Dow Industrials ended down 74 points. The Nasdaq squeaked seven points higher. The oil markets were paying attention because if a rate cut helps the economy, it could increase the demand for energy. Crude surged by $5 to over $67 a barrel, the biggest percentage gain since June. It's still less than half what it was a few months ago, and that's giving drivers a break on gas. The national average dipped to $2.59 a gallon. That's a three-year low. Automakers hope that will encourage Americans to invest in new cars. In the last three months, GM's worldwide sales dropped by 11 percent. The company is pursuing a merger with Chrysler that could save both of them from bankruptcy, but eliminate up to 35,000 jobs. And travelers certainly aren't getting a break on airfares. Ticket prices are the highest they've been in the 13 years that the government has been tracking them. That's your Money Watch. Log on to CBSNews.com for more. At the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Alexis Christophorus.